All right, a while back we got this thing here in the mail. I'm going to show it to you here. Um, and I've been wanting to do a video on this, but just have not had the time to do it. Um, it says here, you might be asking why you received this. Right there. Okay. And then it says, uh, Cross America, 840 Daniel Drive, Kokomo, Indiana, 46901. Um, people who don't know you have prayed over this and are praying for you now. Okay. And they sent this out. All right. I'm just showing what they sent. Send it out nationwide. Even if we have been a, a good person, all of us sin at some point in our life. Because of this sin, we won't go to heaven unless we accept a sacrifice that was made on our behalf. See it? Right there. Okay. Then you open the magic little thing open here, and it says, God sent us His one and only Son. Eh, wrong. His only begotten Son. They're using a new version reading there, John 3.16. Because uh, God had two sons, okay? One created, one begotten. Adam was created, and Jesus Christ was begotten. So it's not true that God sent His one and only Son. Um, God sent His one and only Son to die on the cross as a payment for sin. We can enter the gates of heaven if we do one thing. Okay? And we get down to this down here in a little bit here, but you do... You open up the magic doors here, like that. Wow, look at that. And it says, have, oh, okay, there's, have questions. Follow the Romans 10.9 path to eternity in heaven. If you truly believe in your heart, Jesus is Lord, unreal, then you can declare the following prayer. Dear God, I know I am a sinner. I am sorry and ask you for forgiveness. I now declare with my mouth, Jesus is Lord. I believe in my heart that he died for my sins and you raised him from the dead. In Jesus' name, amen. There you go. Amazing. The Bible doesn't say Jesus is Lord. It says Jesus is the Lord. That's kind of an issue. But you get a nifty little metal cross here. Wow. Looks like you can be a good Catholic. <coughs> I mean, a uh, Christian. Have questions. If you have any questions, email us at questions at crossamerica.net. Simply saying this prayer won't get you into heaven unless you truly believe. Da -da -da. We are here to help you so you can believe and spend eternity in heaven. Okay, um, what about the fact that you're a sinner? Where's the conviction of sin? Where's repentance? Where's, you know? What's next? If you said this prayer, then your life has changed forever. You are still living in an imperfect world. We invite you to visit our website to get helpful tools for your days ahead. There you go. A little uh, ecumenical New World Order. All the different races joining hands and, and you know the globe. We can become global citizens. Yeah. Um, crossamerica.net first supper down at the bottom I'll read this then show it to you fold it back like that then Jesus told him because you have seen you have seen me you have believed blessed are those who have not seen and yet have believed new version well, I'm a big surprise you know the mission of cross America is to send a cross and path to salvation to every home in America if you would like to get involved with this mission in any way, please visit our website at crossamerica.net or stop by our facility to volunteer at, and they give the address. There you go. Okay. And again, they're sending this thing out to everybody out there. That's their goal. I don't know if you've received one of these things yet. been a while since we got this thing. But uh, absolutely ridic ridiculous. This is not the path to salvation. There's no... Hey, you're a sinner. Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners, of whom I am chief. Nothing like that. They give you a little metal cross that you can hang up or whatever else. Um, you see, that's not salvation, right? Easy believism, whatever you want to call it. That's what this is. Okay? So, 
watch out for this kind of heretical nonsense. Thank you for watching.